Good evening. In this tutorial, I'm going to be going over this red look with the gold kind of, it's kind of gold, sort of. I would consider it gold. Look, which may or may not also be continuing to use the Smashbox palettes. I just got these, so all I want to do is use them. But even if you don't have these, you can definitely find substitutes for the colors that I'm using. I also want to say thank you to everyone who left kind comments on my last video, the beauty video with it all zoomed into my face. Really appreciate that. I always say you have no idea how much leaving a kind comment to someone that takes two seconds out of your day could really make someone's day so much much brighter. As always, all the products I use today will be listed somewhere around the video. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Make sure you are still subscribed. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, please feel free to ask me in the comments below. Also, I will go over, since I did not put this in the video, my foundation for this video is a mix of Makeup Forever's Ultra HD and R260 and in Y205, just cause I didn't get the right color so I had to mix these two together. And the lipstick that I'm wearing is also from Makeup Forever and it is C407. And I curled my hair with a flat iron. The very first thing I'm going to do is fill in my eyebrow and I'm going to be using the Gimme Brow from Benefit and then also the Cabral from Benefit. And this Gimme Brow works wonders for just adding color to your natural eyebrow. Now clearly I'm still missing hair all in this section right here. Trying to grow it back in. So I'm just gonna feather in this cabrow in areas that don't really have hair. But never filling it in in just a straight line. I'm kind of going over and up. And I'm just going to gently brush them out. Brush it out, I already have one done, obviously. I'm then going to prime my eye using the Urban Decay Primer Potion in the color Eat It. And if you have wrinkly eyelids like me, you're gonna wanna make sure that you pat it on. Don't drag it on or else A, you're gonna create more wrinkles and B, you're gonna create these weird eyeshadow lines. I'm then gonna be taking my double-sided brush, which I'm pretty much gonna be using the entire video, and going in the Smashbox Matte Eye Palette and using the color Assistant, which is this top color up there, which I honestly think may be like my new favorite neutral shade right now. Now applying that underneath my eyebrow and blending it down a little bit on my lid as well as applying a little bit on my inner corner just to brighten it up. Obviously, I'm having a fun time playing with these little Smashbox palettes right now. I'm then going in the Ablaze palette. I'm using the color Nirvana, which is this red right there. And taking Nirvana in a second brush, I'm actually leaving room underneath my eye so some red can fall underneath. And I'm just going to apply it to my outer corner and my crease. But I'm really gonna build this color up because I do not want it to be like, bam, in your face right away. And as I go along, I'm also gonna be blending this color out. I'm really just taking like very, very little bit of Nirvana on my brush for this. It's always easier to build up than it is to try to take off. Then taking an angled brush, I'm also going to continue to apply Nirvana underneath my eye and continue to blend out as I go along. I'm then going into the metallic palette, which is the one palette that I said I probably wouldn't purchase right away, go figure. And I'm gonna be using the color straight, wait, no, straight up, this one down here. Definitely straight up and definitely the lower one because it has more of a goldy tone to it. But I didn't want anything that was gonna be like overpoweringly gold. I just wanted it to be more of like, almost a champagne, I guess. I didn't want it to look like, you know, football colors. I wanted it to look like Christmas. And I'm also gonna apply this to the inner corner of my eye and bring it underneath my eye a bit, connecting it to the red. Now going into another palette, I know I'm all over the place. We're going to be using Headline, which is this dark red. And that's out of the Smoky palette, which I do also show how to use the green, which I will link in the corner. And I'm just carefully applying it to the outer corners a little bit in my crease and a little bit underneath my eye, but still once again on the outer corner. I'm then going to just tight line my eye, a little bit of Lexorcist, as well as use the Night Owl eyeliner just to add a little bit of an edge. And of course, just apply some mascara, and you're totally welcome to apply fake eyelashes if you wish. 